Today is the first video of a series I'm wanting to do on servicing CB radios on a shoestring budget. The first thing you need to check the power on any CB radio is a dummy load and these can be quite expensive to buy. You can get them for about £18 and you can get them for 300 and something pounds. We're going to make one and I have here a PL259 plug, one of the 6mm types. And I have here a pack of 100 ohm resistors, 100 ohms at 5 watts. I'm going to take two out of the packet. 100 ohms, the colour code is brown, black, brown. 1 O and 1 naught is 100. Now Ohm's law tells us that if we put two resistors in series like that, 100 plus 100 will give us 200 ohms. And Ohm's law also tells us if we put two 100 ohm resistors in parallel, like that, they become 50 ohms. And that's exactly what we want. So we're going to have 50 ohm dummy load. So all we really need to do is to twizzle those two together. I'm going to put some sleeving on there and insert that down the plug and solder it. So that's going to be the first bit and we'll come back to the camera when I've done that. So I extended the wire a little bit so it could be soldered properly at the pin end and we've got the sleeving quite clearly showing that there's no short circuit there. And what I've just done is to get a small file and to just file so we can make a solder join onto the body, the earth of the plug. And there we have the other side now soldered to the body of the plug to just slightly extend that lead again. It's probably easier with the soldering iron I'm using because I'm using an industrial soldering iron so it's going to be needs probably be 45 watts plus to do that. You're not going to do it with a little 15 watt iron. So that's now soldered on there and we can neaten that up if we want to. We can put a bit of sleeving around it. I could have put some sleeving around that uh, the, the earth connection but it would have been more difficult with the sleeving to illustrate this for the video. So there we are, we've popped a bit of heat shrink tubing round that. There's enough leeway there, it's not it's nice and tight, it's not going to interfere with putting that plug into the back of a set. And then we'll just zoom out the camera and I'll show you that it is now 50 ohms on the test meter. And there we have the digital multimeter set up on the 200 ohm range and if I connect my prods across the plug oh there we have 50 ohms don't we and that brings us to another point that meter was only something like £2.99 delivered from China using AliExpress so things don't have to be really really expensive so there you have it, a very cheap to make dummy load comprising a PL259 plug and two 100 ohm 5 watt resistors. I bought those resistors off eBay and that'll be good for normal CB radio. And I'll show you it in use in a subsequent video. Thank you for watching.